I do a few things for Mana Maoli. I'm a kumu here at Kamakao. I teach a music class once a week. And I also do production work for them. Um, I mix songs in the studio and help with producing some of their uh, songs. This is maybe my fourth or fifth year here at Kamakao, but I've known Keola, the founder, for a long time. And I've kind of worked on and off with them on different projects. I really love teaching here. Um, that's one of my favorite things to do. I think growing up I had really good music teachers and it's really nice to be able to pass that on and see the interest that some of the kids have in music and it you know, really reminds me of growing up and learning how to play, um, sometimes staying after class to learn something extra and yeah it's great to be able to pass down everything I've learned to, to these kids. Ho <laughs> One of my best friends is the founder of Mana Maoli, Keola Nakanishi. And I've been a part of his endeavors for a long time now. I've worked in a few different capacities as a mentor to the Haumana, as a, as a performer, and someone who is a confidant to Keola. The name of our mobile studio is Meleana, and she's named after the great-grandmother of our executive director. Meleana was envisioned as a mobile studio so she could serve the maximum amount of Haumana as possible. Mana Maoli is the overall nonprofit that founded Halau Kumana, the public charter school, and we also founded Kanehunamoku Voyaging Academy. And the Manamele project is one part of what Mana Maoli has done. And in the Manamele project, there are three main components, and it's real simple again the people, the stuff, and the curriculum. And the people are comprised of not only the youth and the ohana that we that we serve, but also the hundreds of Mana Maoli collective artists and professionals in the creative industries, which include not just musicians, but music engineers, videographers, photographers, and people in the communications industry. Those are the people. The stuff is Meleana and all the gear that comes with it, the opportunity opportunity that we have to put together awesome videos and audio recordings and our team that does that. And then lastly is the curriculum, which you can find as part of our Music and Multimedia Academy. We do it for the keiki, we do it for the for the next generation. And that's such an important part, you know, to have a vehicle for expression of emotions, thoughts, and creativity. We're speaking to an entirely different generation now than we were 50 years ago. How are they gonna be telling our stories again in 50 years? It's always looking forward, finding ways to be able to preserve what's important to us, but not, not just keep it to ourselves, but to share it with as many people as we can. I'm so excited that Subaru has graciously 
committed to matching up to $10,000 for every nonprofit that we work with through this series. All of these wonderful nonprofit organizations need a little bit extra help, you know, and especially one like Mana Maoli with um, how, how much it costs to have a production, you know what I mean? It'll help them to continue that. Listen to the rain on a Sunday morning. Let it fall, let it wash away all those plans we might have been made yeah, if the sun came out today. Turn off the TV, do something inspiring, electronic devices, put them all away.